it's your girl Taina, but everyone calls me TT, and welcome back to my channel. In today's video will be my routine, my skin routine that I do morning and night. And right now, I'm just washing my hands, getting prepared to start the the video. Yep, washing and washing. Girl, is you done washing your hands? So I'm done washing my hand and now I will be pouring water onto my face. You know, to get it all wet and moist. It, I know some people don't like the word moist, but you know, you know what I mean. Okay, so now I am grabbing my Noxzema that I wash my face with and I will be tucking my bonnet behind my ear so it doesn't get on the bonnet. And now I'm smearing it all on my face. I, I also put it on my neck because I do break out on my neck sometimes. It's not like a lot of break out on my neck, but I do break out on my neck like a weirdo. I don't even know why. But yeah, and now I'm just going to be putting it all over my face, forehead, cheeks, nose, just neck, just everywhere. You actually don't have to use a spin brush you can use a brush like this like the one I'm showing right now but the only reason why I'm not using that is because it's been down under my cabinet for a while now and I just need to buy a new one okay so I'm really making sure I'm getting that face wash in my face rotating it doing um a circle movements just really getting it all in there everywhere after that I do rinse the Noxzema off my hands rinse it off of my hands and I do let it sit on my face just like any other um, any other people that does their like skin morning routine you know how you let your face wash it on your face for a minute yeah I let it I let mine sit on my face while I brush my teeth don't mind me I do this weird thing where I have to prop my leg up while I brush my teeth because it's just comfortable for me I do brush my tongue at the end ladies ladies and gentlemen do not forget to scrub that tongue of yours every morning and night okay okay after i'm done brushing my teeth i do turn the water to like a cool warm water just like a real cool warm water and I rinse it off. Oh, and I forget to mention in the beginning, when I first actually put water on my face, I do like a, a, like a real warm water. And then at the end, a cool warm water, you know, to balance it out. And I rinse my face off. Okay, so I do take my white rag and I do um, put cold water, like very cold water. Okay, I put very cold water on it. You know, I, I have a thing of just keep fucking doing that. Like what's in my mouth. And I just pat it all on my face. I don't really rub, but pat all around my face. Now that I'm done with that, I will be using my little pimple creamer, you know, that magic cream that just gets rid of any of the biggest pimple, littlest pimple on my face. And I just put them in areas where I usually do get pimples at, and I just put them around those areas. 
like as you can see i put it on my cheeks like around like on my sideburns a little around my a little on my neck and do the same thing on the other side and i do put it on my forehead and my nose and my chin because those are the most areas i really kind of get pimples at Mm, y'all see that boom <laughs> that's it and then i'll put the two back and i will um you know like moisturize it in if that makes any sense just oh rub it in that's what i meant i'm gonna rub it in real good i usually put this on my face while my like my face isn't dry dry but it's not like soaking wet either because it just feels better like that than just put it on like dry skin. Mm, after that, I get my Cetaphil Moisturizer. It's good for face and body. It's for all skin types. But I use this just for my face. Like squeeze a little good amount and rub it in on my neck my like on my face just real um ugh, just really rub it in there i do add a little bit more on my neck around my cheek i mean my my lips and around my nose and on like my eyelids because those are the most driest area on my face like those are the area where it gets real real dry so i added like a little extra moisture around those area I don't know if anyone else do that, but this is just my little thing that I do because it just helps me out. And of course now, I'll grab the bio oil, my favorite oil, the, the bomb.com, the creme de la creme. And I'll put like, like two droplets on my hand and then, you know, put it all on my face. Give it, give my face that that nice shine. Gonna keep the moisture in my skin without really like making me look oily. I'm telling you, this is the go-to oil. And now, baby, we are done. And that is the skincare routine. And then I put all my products back to the right side. And after I'm done with my whole skincare routine, I do keep a Blistex in my drawer. And I'll take a Q-tip and I'll put it on my lips. Because, you know, you got to keep your lips nice and moisturized too. So I do this like morning and night, like when I'm done with my skincare routine. 